Greetings to everyone who's listening at home. Yeah, my name is Lungani and I'm a student at VIRT. Um, so in 2017, I matriculated um, in Mahalis Beck State School in Mahalis, uh, in the western side of Gauteng. Um, I matriculated in 2017 and in 2017, I took it upon myself to apply for univers university. But unfortunately, when my marks came and what I had applied for, I was shortlisted and put on a shortlist and couldn't progress to, into the next, um, to be in the year uh, to go to university. So I had to stay home in 2018. So the whole of 2018, I've been in a gap year at home, sitting, doing nothing. Um, I applied, uh, applied, applied, applied um, in, in universities to apply for what I wanted to study uh, in the next year, which is 2019. So it happened that um, in 2017, I applied for NESFAS and I got NESFAS in 2017. I got accepted for 2018, but 2018 I had nest first, but I didn't have school. So fine, that is not a problem. So in 2018, as, as I was in my gap year, it so happened earlier 2018, it so or late 2017, I'm not sure, but somewhere there. So it happened that um, I read a newspaper because I frequented the frequently went to the library to go and pass my time over there. So as I would go there to the uh, library, I found a newspaper. And as I was reading through the newspaper, I saw Connect Mama Bolo. And then when I saw Connect Mama Bolo, I knew I loved Connect Mama Bolo on Skim Sam as Tibos. So I love this performance and then I read the article and then it said that he studied at the University of, of, of Wittbatesrand. I was like, yo, this guy went to the University of Wittbatesrand with his vets to study acting and performance. I really want to do this too. I want to study performance and be on television and be an actor. I mean, I love being an actor. I won't lie to you. Even in matric, when we were studying for exams, or it was exam season, I wouldn't miss a single episode of a single soapy. From six o'clock until nine o'clock, I'd watch every soapy. So, as I saw this article, I was like, I want to apply for Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts at the University of uh, Vith Bathurst. So I did apply for, uh, no, I didn't. So the thing is, I didn't know the name of uh, the Bachelor of Arts and Dramatic Arts back then. I wasn't clued up on which, uh, which name it falls under. So I came to VET, uh, traveled to VET to come and apply in person uh, at the application or at the administration office in the, in the university. So when I came, I went there, I told them what I wanted. I told him that I wanted acting, but they just gave me a list of uh, a form with the list of the things that I want to apply for. And they gave me a, a, a form. They go, they said to me, go and fill it up um, and choose the things that you want to study in, in, in the following year, which is 2019. So I filled it up. I filled because I was in love. I'm, I'm in love with uh, film. I'm in love with acting. I'm in love with music. So those are the things that I'm fascinated about. Um, besides being a, or fascinated by physiotherapy, audiology, and radiography, those, those are the, some of the things that I'm dreaming of uh, becoming in the future. So, but first I need to dream my passion, which is music, uh, film, and performance, which is uh, theater and television uh, and acting. So I chose there, when I saw the names there, I didn't see Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. What I saw was Bachelor of Arts in general. So in Bachelor of Arts in general, I was like, 
it's a general thing it's like a, it encompasses acting and all the other stuff so why not choose it because it encompasses everything i didn't go out to find more information about this thing so that when i apply i apply for the correct thing i didn't do that okay fine it's fine you know actually yes i did i did apply no i a thought came into my mind that i applied for nursing and education so but yeah yeah that is out of the way that was in 2017 when i applied for nursing and education so that is out of the way it's just a thought that came into my mind so i filled up the form next year 2019 I took a gap year 2018 the whole year I was sitting around doing nothing sitting at home going to the library almost, almost every day and when I say almost every day trust me almost every day and the people at the libraries they will they would get annoyed for, of, of me because I would be there every day and they just didn't understand why am I always there like don't I have something to do I mean, of which in July 2018, I found I found work uh, at the chicken farm, uh, a chicken factory, not a farm, a factory, yeah, where they they sell chickens in bags, and they do they manufacture eggs from the chickens. That I found a job there. Even in December, I found I did find a job uh, in in Finn Lakes in a in a flower kind of like company it's a it's a factory where they do flowers yeah they package flowers and then send them to Woolworth and whatever whatever shop but that's beside the point in 2020 20, 2019 that was supposed to be my first year everything is fine I just have to go for registration and then I go for registration as I went to registration now I'm telling the the lady that hey sh you see the thing is I chose Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. No, before that, when the results came out of the other, of the metric 2018, I also got a notification that says, I am accepted at VIT. I'm accepted at VIT. I was like, yes. That was 20, 2019. So I took the offer and then went to register. When I got to the institution to register i told the lady that was you helping me assisting me with our registration i told her i was like um can you because i chose bachelor of arts in, in general uh, can you help me so that when i choose my modules i choose acting and she looked at me and she was like what i'm like yeah can i can you help me choose acting and she's like no nana if you want to do acting, you have to do Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. This is Bachelor of Arts in general. I'm like, what does that mean? And she's like, there's a difference between the two. They're not the same thing. But I can help you uh, choose one module which is offered in, in BA General. That also is offers, offered in BEDA, which is Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts, which is uh, Film, Visual and Performing Arts, which is FVPA. I was excited there was like film visual performing arts that's what i want oh only to find out that's a theory based it's not even focusing on acting yes it does focus on acting but not in act in its actual form but in its like theoretical form in a way that you learn about uh the theories on or the theorists who um have written about uh, the art of performing the art of film the art of visual uh art Th those are the things that the fvp was focusing on hey i was heartbroken i was like okay fine i'll apply for 2020 you see now my time for 2019 2019 i do my first year in ba general and then i apply for the next year for bachelor of arts in dramatic arts now i know the name i apply um for Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. I get, I, I applied. So throughout the year, you have to get, a, you, they give you a letter. I get when you apply, you receive a letter that says you've been, uh, you have, we acknowledge that you have uh, applied for such and such. 
be aware that as you apply for such and such these are the requirements for this and this degree uh, which is one two and three and four yeah bo? so in the in the in the brief it says that uh, we want you to come and audition for for in order to be accepted for bachelor of arts in dramatic arts i was like all right cool that's simple i can do that yeah bo? so now 20 it's 2020 right uh because yeah, it's 2019. Yes, 2019. I'm doing my first year in BA General. So I do my first year. I'm waiting for the. I'm waiting for the audition email to come through to tell me to come to the audition. The year ends. It's December now. I haven't received any email that uh, that says I should come to 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 audition. Hi man. Now it's 2020 January. I haven't I still haven't received any email that says come and audition no I, I go to the to the I, I come to the institution and I go to the administrative office I'm like the thing is I applied for for Bachelor of Arts in dramatic arts but I didn't receive any email that says to me that I should come and do an audition what is going on um, they check they like but we did send you an email I go through my emails, I read the email, but I didn't, like, I saw the email and then clicked on the email, but I didn't read the information in the email. I'm like, oh my god, what a reckless mistake that I have done. I didn't read the content of the email. I received the email, but I didn't read the content of the email. And then that was it. I had to do my second year in Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. No, I have to, in Bachelor of Arts in general, I had to do like my second year. I did my second year. I applied again for Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. This time, I was like, I'm gonna see the email. Whatever, whatever happens, I'm gonna make sure that I read properly my emails. 2020, I'm doing my second year in BA general. As I'm doing my second year, I chow my second year, chow my second year, yeah, well, I, everything is fine. And then I applied, I received the email that says, um, you should audition. Uh, at that time in 2020, um, it was, it was, uh, that time when lockdown was introduced and coronavirus was like introduced. So at that time I was home, so we had to send a self tape of ourselves. Uh, auditioning for for to come to uh, uh, do Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts. So I send myself tape. I send my um, what do they call it? Um, um, it's like a pitch. I don't. I, I forgot what they call it. It's like a pitch. You send it through to the university. You, you write a, a, a whole essay on what you why you think you should be taken. Why you want to study this um this um degree and 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 which movie you have to write an essay on which movie you've watched fortunately for me in bachelor of arts in general i did fvpa and in fvpa we had done canary which is a south african movie where we wrote an essay based on that movie and then also we did like pakistan in english and that's the movie that also we write we wrote like um an essay on pakistan the movie uh but i chose canary because canary was like the most simpler movie that or even the more marks i got it i got more marks on canary essay more than a uh, pakistan essay so i sent the canary uh essay to the university ah 2020 is child 2021 i receive an email you have been accepted for Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Art. Yes, 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 yes. I'm like, oh my God, my answer, my prayers are finally answered. I take, I take the offer. I accept the offer. Now, I did two years of BA General. I'm, I'm funded by Les First. I leave, I love, I leave that degree. It's and BA general. It's like three years. I was supposed to finish my final year, and then that would have been that, and then I would have like graduated and maybe started a new degree on a new 
on a new slate yeah, but, but I didn't think of that I was like ah but a BA general is not a, like uh, a degree where like after finishing it you get something proper or massive nah it's just a degree I was like hey let me leave it and in 2021, I started my first year in Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Art. You couldn't have seen how happy I was studying Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Art. Did my first year, second year, third year, third year, which is last year, 2023, did my third year. Now, this is why I'm making this video. This is why I say, I'm saying I blew it. So, NSFAS can only fund you for five years, which is one, two, three, four, five years. Yeah, bo? And then the standard, uh, standard years for a degree are four years, which is uh, with an additional uh, one year, which is an N plus, in case you have failed in one of these years. So they give you an N plus, which is like a free year that you can add. Tell me why I blew all my years with BA General because of a reckless mistake because of not knowing because of um, not having workshops where people come and give you information on things that you want to do and things that you want to study I blew my years with Nesfas I did two years of BA General which is like two years I did uh, three years of Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts, which is 2019, 2020, 2021, 22, 23. Last year, which was 2023, my year, I chowed like all my five years of NESFAS, which is, I blew them. Yeah, but now, I'm, for Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Arts, I'm left with one year to finish my degree, which is this year, 2024. Where are my NESFAS years? I blew them. I blew all the five uh, five years of Nespers. <sighs> My God, I blew them. You know, but it's it's not that I blew them just like that. I blew them because of of the story I just told you. Why I blew the, those years. So now it's 2024. I must do my final year. And mind you, my final year in Bachelor of Arts in Dramatic Art come with an equivalent of an honors, which means I'll graduate twice uh, with two degrees, an honors and my degree. So I'm currently doing my final year with, uh, with honors as an equivalent of the degree. But now I don't have funding. I, I blew my funding. By that two years that I spent doing, um, doing Bachelor of Arts in general, I blew them. God damn it, I, 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 I regret. I don't know. I don't know why I regret because it was out of my control. But like, I'm, I'm hurt. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm hurt more than anything. So this is my final year. And what happened is that I started a GoFundMe or a Phoenix account that is out there. Um, if you check on my some one of the links in this YouTube channel, you'll see my um, social media account. If you click on them, you'll find a link. Just go on that link or a link tree. Click on the link tree. There's a couple of links on that. If you want to donate, please feel free to donate as little as 20 rent. Um, I'd, I'd really appreciate it if you did uh, um, uh, donate for me. Uh, I really appreciate that. So in terms of my future plans, after finishing this degree, um, I'm hoping to study, to study because our, uh, the degree that I've studied right now, to be honest, Whew. to be honest, with this degree, um, it's hard. It's hard to choose any art degree. Had I known, had I known better, I would have started with a professional degree that where 
a job is guaranteed and then followed up with this passion degree where like i know it's a freelance job but i'm not gonna be employed I'm, i'll be freelancing but my future plans now is to study audiology physiotherapy or radiography those are my like three three things that i I think in the future I would like to study um, with any with any help that I receive from anywhere because I've been apply I, I did apply for those things and for next year because this is my final year I'm done with this I'm gonna be done as soon as it says November I'll be done with this degree and then for next year I'll hopefully I start a new degree either in audiology physiotherapy or radiography I wanna be a doctor dog. <laughs> I want to be a doctor so I, I did apply for a few bursaries there and there but the, the biggest thing is that I don't want to graduate with a debt so I want to graduate debt free and hence why I did hence I did um, a GoFundMe and a Phoenix account so that people can donate towards my uh, education I know I know it's I should have known better but we are here uh, there's no use in pointing fingers saying this is what you should have done this is what you could have done um so that's my story i blew it thank you for watching Bruh.